Title, The Shadows Embrace. In the quiet, sleepy town of Willowbrook, nestled between the towering pines and the whispering willows, lived a woman named Lily. She was a kind, gentle soul, with a heart as warm as the summer sun. But beneath her serene exterior, a darkness was brewing, a darkness that would soon consume her. Lily's life was simple and uncomplicated until the day she met him. He was a stranger, a man of few words, with eyes as black as the night. She first encountered him at the local library, where he stood, staring at the bookshelves, as if searching for something. Lily, being the kind soul she was, approached him and offered her assistance. Can I help you find something? she asked, her voice as soft as a summer breeze. He turned to face her, and she was struck by the intensity of his gaze. I'm looking for a book on the occult, he replied, his voice low and gravelly. Lily, being a lover of all things mystical, guided him to the appropriate section. As they browsed the shelves together, she felt a strange connection to this mysterious man. It was as if they were two pieces of a puzzle, destined to fit together. As the days passed, Lily found herself drawn to the stranger. They would meet at the library or at the local cafe and discuss the mysteries of the universe. But as their conversations grew deeper, Lily began to sense a darkness within him, a darkness that seemed to grow with each passing day. One evening as they sat in the park, watching the sunset, Lily finally mustered the courage to ask him about the darkness she sensed. You seem troubled, she said, her voice barely above a whisper. Is there something you'd like to share? He turned to face her, and for a moment, she saw a flicker of fear in his eyes. I've been followed, he confessed, by a shadow, a darkness that seems to be growing stronger with each passing day. Lily's heart raced as she listened to his tale. She knew that the darkness he spoke of was real, for she too had begun to feel its presence. It was as if the shadow was stalking them both, waiting for the perfect moment to strike. As the days turned into weeks, the shadow's presence grew stronger. Lily began to see it in the corners of her eyes, a dark, ominous figure that seemed to be watching her every move. She tried to ignore it, to convince herself that it was all in her mind, but the shadow refused to be ignored. One night, as Lily lay in bed, unable to sleep, she heard a soft knock at her door. She rose from her bed, her heart pounding in her chest, and opened the door to find the stranger standing on her porch. I need your help, he said, his voice trembling. The shadow has grown too strong. I can feel it closing in on me, and I fear that it will consume me. Lily knew that she couldn't turn her back on him, not now. She took his hand and led him into her home, where they sat together, discussing the shadow and the darkness that seemed to be consuming them both. As they talked, Lily began to realize that the shadow was not just a figment of their imagination, but a real malevolent force that was stalking them both. She knew that they needed to find a way to defeat it, to banish it from their lives forever. Together they researched the occult, searching for a way to rid themselves of the shadow's embrace. They found an ancient ritual, a ritual that promised to banish the darkness once and for all. On the night of the full moon, they gathered the necessary ingredients and performed the ritual. As they chanted the ancient words, the shadow grew stronger, its presence filling the room. But Lily and the stranger were not afraid. They knew that they had to face the darkness head on, to confront it and banish it from their lives forever. As the ritual reached its climax, the shadow grew more and more powerful its form taking shape before their eyes. But Lily and the stranger were not deterred. They continued to chant, their voices growing louder and more confident with each passing moment. And then, in a flash of light, the shadow was gone. The room was once again filled with the soft glow of the moonlight, and Lily and the stranger were left standing, their hearts filled with a sense of triumph and relief. From that day forward, Lily and the stranger remained close, 
their bond strengthened by their shared experience with the shadow. They knew that the darkness would always be a part of their lives, but they also knew that they had the strength and the courage to face it together. And so, the story of Lily and the stranger became a tale of love and courage, a tale of two souls who faced the darkness and emerged victorious. And as the years passed, their story became a legend, a legend that would be told and retold, a testament to the power of the human spirit to overcome even the darkest of shadows. Thank you for diving into the spine-chilling mysteries with Chills Unveiled. If you've enjoyed the eerie tales and creepy narratives that send shivers down your spine, make sure to subscribe to our channel for more hair-raising content. Hit that notification bell so you never miss an unveiling of the unknown. Join the community of thrill-seekers and let the darkness unfold. Subscribe now and let the nightmares continue.